Hello, I am Fishing Wheelbag Official, and we are at a top secret location. I'm not gonna tell you guys this place, but today we're white fishing. Not fishing with rods, but just netting. I hope you enjoyed this video. Welcome to the annual Skillhouse Whitefish Derby. Whoever catches the biggest fish or whitefish will be taking home a massive trophy like this big. Okay, who else did we bring bite fishing with us? Pickles! We also brought the pickles. You have to start from the end of October to the beginning of November. And this fall was kind of weird because we don't have snow yet. Okay, so. Step one to catching whitefish, get a net. Step two, find Lake Superior. And the next step is get your hip waders on, if you have any. If you don't, go buy some, I guess. And turn on your headlamp. This is a headlamp right here. <laughs> or a spotlight. Walk into the water aimlessly, make sure you don't trip. Look for the whitefish, and when you see them, Scoop them up. Hopefully you have great netting skills. Warning, the waves could be massively big, like it is right now. And we're not going in right now because the waves are ridiculously huge. You can't see them because it's dark though, but they are huge. It's not dark enough yet, it has to be pitch black. But fortunately, we did see some over there, but they're too far out yet because the waves are too big. So when the waves calm down a bit, they will come in. Hey, what? Okay. I'm fishing right now. Woo! It's wavy. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah! Yay! 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 Bring it over, bud. That's another one. Way to go, Brock. Got two. <laughs> I, I think I have the fattest so far. That's my white fish. <laughs> That's what a white fish looks like. See ya, I told you they're here. On thing, bro! <laughs> but yeah, he's even got some eggs on his head. He's got eggs all over him. That thing looks like it passed out. Oh boy. He does have eggs all over him. Look at that. That thing looks like it passed out. Emmett, what do you think? Dude, that thing is disgusting. It looks like it passed out. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, that one too. All right, dump it in. For that. Yes. Holy cow, 20, 21 and a half. Wow, that's a good size. Right. That's not bad. Yeah. Okay, Opa's got 20 and a half. That's just inch side by nine. And yours is? And they can't go so far. And they don't go any farther. Viewers, so right now you can't see anything, but I think now, three, two, one, turn around, Dad. Look at that. Second scoop. That one was caught on the second scoop. Nice. Oh. Wait a minute. How come this one's going to work? So where's the tail? Straight out. This one's tail straight out. Oh, yeah. It's 19 and a half. Yeah. in the black okay. one. Hey, look at that. You already caught one that's 19 and a half. I got it. You can do it, Molly. I hope she gets one. Okay, so. This is Molly's first time white fishing. Let's see if she can get her first one. She's never done it before. <laughs> oh, he won't stop. Yeah, once you get going, it's. <laughs> Two white fish in one scoop. <laughs> All right, cool. I got two. There <laughs> well, she is. Here. Eighteen inches. We are white fishing. This is alive. See, if you come over here, we have like nice sandy bottom, and that's where these like to spawn. And I know that because I see one right there. Almost had him. The dock lets you um, 
or makes them come out. Three, two, one. Oh, look at that. I already have one. So, I'm just gonna. Look at that. It's a whitefish. Right you might think they look like eels. Let's yeah. see, look at those eyes. That's why they like the dark. You see their mouths? They're bottom feeders. Imagine having one of these for a pet. <laughs> Should I keep this guy or release him? Yeah. Put him in the fish tank at home. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Here's the underwater release, and this is a first ever in the nighttime underwater release with a white fish. We have two underwater releases that you guys are gonna be seeing. You grab one, suckers. You're back here, you're like salmon. You think you're so powerful, but you're not. And underwater we go. says you can't keep whitefish for pets. I'm kidding, we're flaying that guy. I thought I would never see this. Neither would I. It's okay. <laughs> they, they won't move, hon. They're dead. Ew, it's so like... Yeah, they're gross. Spicy. Ew. <laughs> Eddie's it! You're gonna catch me! <laughs> Look at this, look at this. Oh, do we have a winner? Oh, it's over 22. 22 and a half. Woo! And this is the board. Okay, where's your name? Right here. I came in sixth place. It's on mine, is yeah, it? Yeah, at least I beat you, Dad. <laughs> yeah, is it mine? <laughs> the winner of the 2021 Skillhoss Whitefish Derby is Edwan. <laughs> Go ahead. How big was yours? Yeah. 24 inches. Yeah. Nice job. <laughs> All the way from South Africa. <laughs> uh, well, thank you guys. It was great. Like, really. <laughs> Speech. <wanted. laughs> like, honestly, the best fishing of my life. Like, the experience. Like, I think apart from my first night of marriage, this was probably the second. Oh, no. <laughs> Cut. It was a very successful whitefish season. And I'm super happy that I didn't win because now someone else just to feel like what it is to catch the biggest whitefish. Mine was 22 and a quarter and Edwan's was 24, but he was, he met when he measured it, it was 23, but he didn't squeeze the tail. So if he did, it would have been 24. He won. So that makes me really happy that I didn't win. Thanks for watching. I hope you like and subscribe.